everyone, and welcome to my Grandma Gamers channel. I'm Mia, and this is my B&E series of breaking and entering into people's Final Fantasy XIV homes. So join me and be my accomplice, and let's go and scope out some of the neighborhoods in Final Fantasy XIV. Let's get ready and go. Hi, everyone. Grandma Mia here. And do you see this huge house behind me? Isn't that big? Ha! They've got to have lots of really good things in there. That's the next house on the list for us to clean out. I mean, um, clean up. So, let's go find out who owns this house and, um, let's go clean it out. I mean, clean it up. CS Gaming Castle. <gasps> oh, good grief. It's a castle. Wait. CS Gaming Castle? Somalia? Oh, that's that winch! That's the one that was doing all the gossiping in the Adventurers Guild. And that's how I found out about how they have a lot of money. Oh, wait. What does this greeting say? It says, Grandma, I'm on to you? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. She thinks she's on to me. Hmm. Anyway, this is the Corral server, and we're in the mist. Ward 11, plot 32 for the CS Gaming Castle for the home of Somalia. Huh. <laughs> Wait till she comes home and finds out what she's missing. She'll really be on to me then. <laughs> Okay, so let's go check out her yard and find out what's going on and her stuff. Okay, this is huge. Oh, look at there's a Carby. I wonder if I can get up on Carby. My jumping skills, they just really are bad. Oh, well, we won't play with Carby anymore. Okay, the Shishi. Oh, look at I haven't seen a purple one of these. I've seen a red and I've seen white but not purple. That tea house bench, that looks nice. Oh, she's growing things other than dirt. See, she's really rich. She's smart. She makes a lot of money from growing things. She's got a Sephiroth tr tree out there and, oh, this is interesting. She's got snow trees because there's snow down here and the leaves are dropping snow, falling snow trees. Hmm. Okay. Oh, she's got another one over here. Yep, these are snow trees because there's no snow anywhere else. And she's got some water and oh wow, she doesn't have the hot seat. <laughs> like everybody else in this FC has the bench warmer going. Okay, so let's go out and check out Somalia's house even though she thinks she's on to me. <laughs> okay, wow. I like this already. Look at the fake stained glass window up there with the samurai guys. That looks pretty cool. That looks like a real window and everything. And I like this green. I like green anyway. I think that's the, I want to say, I want to say it's the Marlboro green, but I don't know if that's it or not. But I like that green. I like how she's got that set up. She's got that lava lamp or the Lord Levine lamp with the lava coming out of it, electricity coming out of it, whatever it's supposed to be. And of course she's got the barber shop and the summoning bell and oh wow look at this. Oh I like the the blue and the green with the um the Moogle chandelier modular or whatever that's that's called. Look at all the statues. These are going to fit nicely in our backpacks and they are going to sell for really well. And then she's made the window back there. Oh look, check this out. This is one of those, what are they, the Marmot? Marmot? Marmot. <laughs> Marmot? Marmot? Lanterns. That is too cute. That is way too cute. We're going to have to take that with us. And look at all the statues and everything. I like this. This is pretty. 
I like that green and the blue together. That looks really good. Okay, so, okay, check this out. This is like the kitchen area for everybody. Must be good food because like the plates are empty. And look at, oh, oh, I bet these are filled with fine silverware and fine china. Oh, so pretty. Gabby, grab that little elixir vase. Those are pretty cool. And look at, oh, fruit. Don't mind if I do. I'll take some, thank you. And we're gonna have cake on the way out. Man, people eat here like crazy. So, let's go downstairs. And check out the downstairs. Oh, she knows some tricks. Put the rug up here and the fox kitten. Oh, wow. Look at this. I like this in black. This is, oh, wow. The stage is what? Like a purplish pink color? I've never seen a stage like that. <gasps> oh, wow. Look at that. Oh, that is absolutely gorgeous. Look at that. She's got the fire pits. I've never seen this color used in any of the houses before. And I've been in a lot of houses in the last couple of years. But this like pinkish purple is really pretty with the bamboo back there with their fake portal and all the statues with the black and white shells. Oh, that is just absolutely gorgeous. With the, um, the pink or purple, whatever color this is for the fire pits and everything. Wow, that is just beautiful. And um, the, I'm just amazed at all of this. That is just absolutely, it's just beautiful. That's gorgeous. I wonder what's back here. <laughs> uh, this is in like the reds and the rusty red colors and books. And oh, check how she made the the bed. It's got like its own private deck. That is, that's the new handgun bed. And so that is really with the elephant in the bedroom. Oh, there's a note. We're gonna ignore the note for right now because we've got lots to explore. Oh, wow. I mean, this whole, this whole area is just beautiful. And this out here is just, oh, that's just so pretty. <laughs> that's a great idea for this big area. Ah, it's late. Okay, but I wanna get through this house and so because I have to do the um, event tomorrow, the, I forget the name of it, but it's like the Halloween event. <laughs> and it's like midnight here and um, I'm getting tired. But I like the stained glass window. Um, with the samurai guys. This just looks really nice. Okay, let's go up here. Let's see what's over here. Oh, she's got like the, um, the Ar Ar Armen, Armen, Armen stuff up here with the cookies and the treats and everything like that. And then there's the Tonberry guy. Wonder if she knows that this guy runs around with a knife hanging around hanging out, probably robbing people. I'll blame him next. But this just, there's so much back in here that makes this look so super cool. This is just a lot of fun back here, this room. I probably could never get any sleep with all the stuff going on back there. Okay, what's over here? Oh, we got the squishy stuff in a blue. We got a room with just the squishy stuff. And I think this is squishy too. I think it sounds squishy. Yeah, it does, but this is squishy. And I mean, just a little room and the throne room. And she's got all kinds of colors going on here. Just lots of things. And then she's, oh look, 
this is all just got this all decorated as well this area that a lot of people don't do anything with or they might just put like one or two things up here but I think it's becoming more and more popular with people decorating this area but she took a ru the rugs and she like put them all down here and then put rugs on top of rugs this just looks really nice and then it's the bathtub and a seating area with fish oh great a fritz in the fish tank with the I like those blue fish. Hmm, I'm going to have to get one for one of my fish tanks because those fish are cool. I like them. And we've got this South Sea set. And oh, this is, oh, there's food. I'm hungry too. Working all day, cleaning out house, I mean, cleaning up houses. I'm hungry. Hmm. This is that um, combed wool rug, and she's painted it green. This is nice, and I like this. I mean, there's so much going on with so many different colors, but yet it all looks great, and it all comes together really nicely. This is just really nice. Just so much, and so pretty. Is there anything up there? No. Nope. She's got so much stuff in here. Wow, this is just, look at the entry from this way with the doors. This is just really super nice. Oh my gosh, I, one minute I was on the stairwell and the next minute I'm down in this little secret private room with all these really fun goody things. So we're just gonna have to clean out this room before we leave. But look at this. She's got the Tonberry bed mixed in with the Garuda bench. And she's got planters down here and a bed down here and a desk. And there's a note. But look at all this food. She knows my weakness. Food. And over here, there's cookies. So, wow. And that note. That note is for me. I don't think I want to read the note. Because I saw my name. Hmm. So, okay, well, you know, I'll just eat a cookie and read the note. And it says, so, Grandma Mia, well, that's me, from the Grandma Gamer Gang. I figured out you're the leader of that gang and that you are really not a maid. I haven't told anyone in my FC yet that you're, that you're a grandma that likes to game. Seriously? Is that what she meant by I figured you out? That I play games? Seriously? Do you think anybody's going to believe her when she says, that old lady plays games? <laughs> but, and it, then it goes on and says, but if you clean all the silverware in the kitchen that needs to be polished, mop and polish the floors, dust all the statues, Oh, and we have a talent show next coming up soon, and I need a puppet since mine broke. And you're just about the right size. Get my meaning? You do all of these things, and I won't spill the beans and tell people that you're an old granny that likes to game. <laughs> I don't think anybody's going to believe her anyway. <laughs> oh, so go ahead and tell. <laughs> I hope... You enjoyed this video and all the other videos that go along with this FC. They are so much fun, and I've had a blast. Please check out my other videos that go along with this series with the Unbroken FC chain. They, um, oh, and check out my other videos as well. You can easily push like and subscribe buttons. This is Grandma Mia for Grandma Gamer's channel. Take care, have fun, and be safe out there.